Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we are trying Bandle Tale, a League of Legends story. I didn't try it before, I just saw a couple of videos. I'm not really sure what this is and how it plays, but it looked cute, so why not? And I do play League of Legends. So let's just say I am a fan. What is this? They, I'm not a they. I'm a he. Yes. Hairstyle. Hmm. They're a bit too pixelated. I can't really tell. Okay. Ears. I'm gonna go with a with an elvish type. Wait, 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 wait. We're gonna go purple. Okay. Purple white hair. Shirt color. Wait, there's a purpler color? No, it's not. This is more like a pinkish something. Oh my god, this is so horrible. <laughs> this huh I don't know what this is but that looks cool today I'm gonna tell you a story about one brave little yordle okay Maybe you've heard it already Everyone in Bandle City knows this one. Bandle City is an incredible place full of magic. It was built by us Yordles, and we filled it with our dreams. Every Yordle can find a way to be happy here with the help of their friends. But when this story took place, not everything was perfect. Once this paradise got sick and it was torn apart. Our hero lived on an island at Bandle City's outskirts, Yarnville. Back then, our hero was a shy homebody, whose daily routine consisted of only two things. Knitting lessons with their teacher, Gramps and spending time with their friend Clover, who would come over and talk for hours, dreaming about the future. Our hero could barely imagine the adventures waiting for them. Well, actually, they could. Because this is exactly how our story begins. It all starts with dreaming big. Big dreams. Ooh, this is cute. Look, is that me? Yes. Um, okay, I guess. <laughs> Party! Party hard! Let's get drunk! Do they even have alcohol in Bandle City? Look, it's Tristana! <laughs> and also Vega! <laughs> Where is he? Oh, he's there as well. Present you the Yordle everyone's crazy about. Who? The party planner of the century! And most importantly, my bestest friend in the whole wide world. What was your name again? Bruh. Welcome, Jack. Hmm. 
Hey Jack, wake up! It's Gramps. He can't see the poster. What poster? Dude, what do you have in your on your wall? Oh my god, the walking is so weird. What what is this real life? Were you up late knitting again? Wait, is that Gramps as in Grandma or Grandpa? Sure you are sleepy heads. Look, look what. Bring Ozzy's party poster. I don't think this is Grandma. <clears throat> If you're so scared of Gramps finding your poster, why keep it? It's my only window into what's happening in Bandle City. Yeah, our little island is nice, but don't you wonder what life was like before we got separated? Oh, I've got plenty of adventures right here. <laughs> well, if it's adventures you want. I've heard there's a flying cat in Darner's Glade. Wanna go investigate? Sounds like a lot of running around. I'd only slow you down because of my leg. Oh, that's why I'm skipping around? No way, I love your leisurely strolls. It's okay, I'd rather stay here and knit. But I'll be glad to hear about the adventure afterwards. Sad face. Don't worry. When you're ready, we'll take Yarnville by storm. Wait here, I will be back in no time. Bye bye. Okay, back to meeting. The yarn spinner header head is out of alignment, okay. How do we realign it? I'm gonna need my repair multi tool. What a weird contraption. This is the Revitio menu here. You can quickly switch between menus. Press the icon to view your inventory. Okay. Okay. Wait, but that doesn't have any logic. Okay, I don't want to throw things out right now. Finally, the best part of the day, knitting. What the heck kind of life do you have, my boy? What is this? Are these coins? Level up skills? Experience points rather? Did you find the cat? Oh, it's the grandpa papa. You lost the cat? Wait, we own a cat? <laughs> oh, Gramps, I thought you were someone else. Hopefully not the cat, I'm not that fuzzy. <laughs> funny grandpa. Anyway, I have some good news. Since you're my best student, aren't I the only student? I'm your only... <laughs> sure. Your 101 year apprenticeships is ending. I think it's time for you to go out into Yarnville again. Yeah, wait a second. Okay, okay, it's good. Gramps, 
I know, I know you like it here. You don't want to slow down anybody. I respect that. Gramps is cool though. Which is why I use my most advanced knitter magic to weave you this leg. What do you mean? I don't have a leg. I may not be the knitter I once was, but I've put my heart into these stitches. Yeah, that's just weird, man. I know you have a lot of adventures ahead of you. You don't have to use it, but I want you to have the option. Gramps, I, I don't know what to say. <laughs> Let's discuss this. Say, tomorrow. See you then. But this is your house? <laughs> Man, grandpa is cool. Whoa, a neat leg. Equip your new leg. I already forgot how to do this. Ah, yes, the tab button. So I can equip a hat, a leg for some reason, a weapon, a some kind of tool and whatever this is, second weapons, what's this, a house, brain, I'm guessing these are experience points. Oh now we're, now we're fast, oh yeah. It works! That's so cool! Clover's going to be blown away! Away, away, away. Talk to Winstock. Is that a guy over there? I'm finally out of my house. <laughs> my guy has been trapped inside his house for his whole life. Hello. Rosalind? Dear me, Winstock, is that Jack I see? Nice to see you out and about, my boy. Oh, hi. Have you seen Clover? No, we haven't. Try asking Frankel. Or is it Frankie? I think it's Frankel. Chop, chop. My favorite customer. Care to buy some groove spinners? How am I his favorite customer if I was trapped inside my house? Actually, I'm looking for Clover. So is that a no on the Grove Spinners or...? Fine, she went towards the Darner's Glade Bridge. The unraveling one. It's high time someone fixed it. Thanks, I'll see what I can do. Let's fix the bridge. What's this? Okay. What's this? The bridge definitely needs fixing. Oh, look, it's Yumi. No way, the cat is flying. Emotions. Actions that you perform will fill your emotion orbs. The more orbs you fill with emotions, the more skill points you can earn from them. Oh, I see. So I was kind of right. Here's how many skill points you already have. Blah, 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 blah. Here you can see how many skill points you will gain from the emotion orbs you've filled. Repairing, building, crafting items, eating, completing quests and seeing beautiful places will fill your emotion orbs. Fair enough. Doing the same thing over and over again gets boring though. You will get fewer emotion points for repeated actions over time. Okay. That is the sloppiest job I have ever seen in my life. So beautiful. Maybe staying home for so long was a mistake. You think? I have literally stayed in my home for 15 years and only gone out on Fridays and Saturdays <clears throat> because I literally have nothing better to do
Okay, wasn't this my home? What? <gasps> What's happening? Is this a Nitter's backpack? Yo, no way. Hey, this is my nap cave. You can talk? I can do whatever the heck I want. This is my nap cave after all. It's not a cave, it's a house that transforms into a backpack. <clears throat> Wait, so it like... Goes smaller? Every knitter gets one at the end of their training. Wait, you're a knitter? Need something for me then. A ball of yarn so she can play with it. Let's see. We have three orbs over there. Do I level up when they get filled? Here you go. Meow. I like it. You can stay. I hate you, me. How did you get here? I was on an important mission of looking for a place to sleep. <laughs> Figures. So you're not from around here? Nope. I've got this awesome magic book that helps me travel. Lucky you. Who said that? Wait, who did say that? The most charismatic piece of trash in this backpack. Um, where are you? Hot. Whoa, there's a book under all this garbage. Amazing. Now we both have magic books. Is that a sock with glasses? Yep. You're a yordle. In your sock. See how that feels? Sorry. Didn't expect both a talking cat and a talking sock. <laughs> I think it's getting way too crowded in here for us book. We've got important adventures to go on anyway. It was nice meeting you, Nitter. Maybe we'll see each other again. So what's your deal? Some yordle has put me inside his book like some bookmark. Ugh. I don't even know where my pair is. Oh, oh right, there's two socks. Maybe we can find them if we clean this place up. Then we'll go find Clover. Do you have the skills to do that? Huh? Yordles get skills by turning emotions into experience. Okay, I already know that. How do you know that? I wasn't the bookmark for a young adult novel, was I? Page 67, paragraph 2. It says here I need to dream. Uh, that makes sense, kind of. Rise and shine. You should be able to clean the trash now. Okay, okay. Mm hmm. This is the skill tree. Here you can acquire skills and crafts. Okay. Now close this window and let's clean. No other socks. But we are going to find your pair, I promise. Who this? Clover is back! Is this a Nitter's backpack? You lucky son of a gun. Whoa, Jack, I've been looking all over for you. You walked all the way here. Gramps gave me this neat leg. I was trying to surprise you. So, surprise, I guess. That's awesome, ready to take it on an adventure. Well, you've already missed the flying cat. Really? Yep, I also found the order badge book. A badge book? 
Now let's see, there's a knitting pupil badge. I've been doing that for a hundred years already. New homeowner. Now that's a weird one. A good friend. That is definitely me. These are knitter's badges. Only a real knitting master can earn them all. Wait, remember how Ozzy left his backpack house behind when he moved away? Maybe this is it. If I could fix this up, Gramps would be blown away. Well, now we have a reason to go talk to Ozzy. He's throwing a party today. I didn't want to tell you before. Gramps would never let us go. Gramps doesn't have to know everything. We can just get the portal there. In and out, a 20 minute adventure. Besides, maybe Ozzy can help us with the badge stuff. What you say? You know what? Let's go! Here we are. The portal to Bandit City is right across this bridge. Okay, we need to fix another bridge. Which is, wait, why does every bridge in this city is destroyed? What's happening? Can't believe this place used to be a Yordle attraction. Yeah, I wonder why. Maybe it's because the bridge is. Yeah, even the bridge is down. Mm -hmm. Why did Grams cut us off from the rest of Bandle City anyway? You're asking the wrong Yordle. Yo, I see things, I go and interact. I'm a simple Yordle. Okay, let's fix the bridge. We cannot fix the bridge. Oh, I need to press tab, okay. Here you see all available badges you discovered. Okay. Let's choose one of them. You can see the badge description in progress. Small step for your little kind, but a huge step for me. I'm finally ready for an adventure of my own. Let's hope my 101 years of knitting have not been in vain. <coughs> I thought he was gonna say something else. Uh, quest list. The adventure begins. Okay, here you have a quest. Okay. Repair. This is the. Okay. Okay. You can always open the book to get more familiar with badges and quests. Let's select the highlighted text in your quest objective. This is the map of the island you're currently on. Mm -hmm. On the first tab you can see all places where a quest is available. On the second tab you can see all the characters who live on the island and their location. Okay. You can see all the resources you're able to collect here. Okay. Can zoom in with plus and minus. I don't like that. Why can't I use my uh, mouse wheel? You care to view the world map? There's like five zones. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. The yarnlets. I need to rest first. What? I think it gives too much experience. <clears throat> Gee, I feel like a third wheel with all this backstory. You're a third sock. Oh no, <laughs> I just realized what I said. <laughs> He's talking sock I found in a pile of junk, okay. That's a lot to take in. Bro, stop saying weird stuff. Yeah, yeah, nice to meet you too. I hate to say it, but Clover kind of has a point. We shouldn't draw attention to ourselves at the party. Fine, I'll shut my face around other yordles. Thank you. 
Here's the portal. Let's go. Super Mario Brothers. Super Yordle Brothers. Feels like all of Bandel City is here. Okay. Where's Timo? It's Ozzy. Are you guys knitters? Be cool, be cool, be cool. Um, yeah. There are some big fans of yours, Ozzy. Nice to see your dolls with good taste. Yes, sir. But tell me about you. I haven't seen a knitter in like a hundred years. How's Gramps? He's great. I'm his student, actually. Oh, wait, so everyone calls him Gramps. I'm not his nephew. He's... Everyone's is Gramps. Okay, I kind of get it now. Yo, the light became so bright. So you're the new Ozzy, you know, Oh my god, sorry. But I'm almost done with my apprenticeship, actually. Fun stuff, for a while at least. We found your badge book. You want it signed, right? Not exactly. We also wanted to ask about your backpack house. Can we keep it, please, please, please? Oh, I lost that a long time ago. We'll do it as you will. Besides, I'm kind of in the middle of something right now. But I could always use a pair of extra paws to help me. We're throwing a party? Really? But wouldn't Gramps mind? Eh. Eh. Gramps minds most things that aren't beet salad. Oopsie. Knitting's fine and all, but it's not exactly sign my poster material. He and I never shook on it though, so if you're team Gramps, I don't mind. No, we're team Ozzy all the way. Right on. Now, about that help I mentioned. The spotlight could use some checking. I'm on it. What is this place? I can't go away. The best place to party, if you ask me. We're at the Unity Tree. In addition to the view, it's a great place for making portal yarn and whatnot. Gramps probably talked about... Talked your ears off about that stuff, though. Let's just, let's just get to the fun part. Man, I, I can't read anymore. Yeah, sure, I'm all about making yarn. I still can't move. I also haven't installed the fireworks yet. Also, check the music and the buffet. I got fireworks. You can do that in any order. When you're done, you'll get the honor of charging the portal. Can I move? Look, there's Vagar and Tristana. What's this? Welcome to the party, Tristana. Was that supposed to mean Vegar? Are you up to something? Hey, I'm just showing some hospitality! I actually did his voice. <laughs> Whatever. If you do have some kind of scheme here, I'll expose you in no time. <laughs> but what was this, though? What happened here? Who's this? Gerbo. What's up? Ozzy sent me to check the buffet. Someone needs to serve a couple more dishes. Might as well be you. Grab them from the chest, please. Sure. Why not? A plain bun, beet soup, and stuffed flatbread. Yo, Vegar has no taste. Done. Nothing's broken? Nice. I knew shifting this on you was a good idea. Because you're lazy. Okay. Fair enough.
No, fireworks. I wouldn't trade them for anything. Haven't you seen fireworks a million times? Yes, and... Ozzy doesn't even change the order of the shots. It's the same flashing lights again and again and again and again and again. What a bore you are, Jasper! I sell essentials, Penelope. The orders prefer when I'm boring and reliable. Yo! My god... My alarm. I was supposed to wake up at this hour. I, well, I woke up two hours ago and I forgot to close the alarm. My bad. Let's finish this. Okay. Good job. You know, you actually remind me of me when I was a young, handsome young fella. Before I got awesome, of course. Oh god. He flipped on me. You guys have been very helpful, as promised. You deserve the honor of starting the party. Whoa, really? Yay, hooray. Wait, stop! What's that? Party yarn. Yada yada. Not that interesting. Just tie it to the main ball of yarn and let's start the party. <clears throat> okay, Jack, don't screw this up. Don't screw this up. Don't screw this up. Hello, Bandle City! I know I say this every time, but tonight's very special party. We have two guests from Yarnville. They'll be responsible for the most important thing, the portal we're charging! Don't be nervous, don't be nervous. This is everything I've ever dreamed of. Really? I know you said to keep mum, but sheesh. That is one tangled ball of yarn. Right is um right. The portal doesn't really look safe at all. Jack, take a chill pill. I'm sure Ozzy has it all figured out. You're also right. The bottom line is, what could possibly go wrong? The biggest explosion of your life. from all around gathered for another party. Well, this wasn't just another party. This time Ozzy promised something very special. I mean, he always promises something special. But this time he gave the honor of starting the party to someone else. It seemed like our hero knew what to do. They had some special knitting knowledge after all. But then everything went so wrong. The portal exploded into pieces. The portal started to collapse. It sucked away the entire party mood. And a couple of unlucky yordles, like Ozzy and Clover. And that was just the beginning. There was a chain reaction, and everything around Vandal City started to collapse. Bridges shook and fell apart. In Greensprout Grove, a great tree fell. Not the tree. A huge blast rattled Gadgeton. Hi, Mordingo. And something happened to Inspiration Isle. Nobody could tell what exactly was wrong there, but they could all feel it. And Lulu is there. This hour of danger. Vandal City was lucky to have a protector like me. Oh my god. When I fight for what I believe in, I never lose. Tristana is narrating? Well, maybe I sometimes lose a little hope. It's hard saving everything and everyone all the time. But I started with saving our hero. So they could help me. But not like they helped Ozzy. If you know what I mean. <laughs> Phew! You're okay! Had me kind of worried for a minute. What happened? I'm not sure. Some kind of energy wave hit the whole island. Hello. Where is everybody? I saw a few yordles getting sucked into the portal. Including Ozzy and your friend. I'm very sorry. Oh no. We've got to get him back. We'll do that. We'll do what we can. 
For now, help me check if any other yordles around here need help. Just a second. Yo, the the playthrough is getting a little long. I need to save, but I, to save I need to sleep, and I can't sleep anywhere. Are you okay, sir? That was kind of scary. I'm hoping that the worst is over. Portals are pretty important to trading. If something happened to them, we might have to say goodbye to that for some time. Okay. Run. What? Thank you. Get Jasper too. This is a what? <laughs> this is statistically the worst party I've ever been to. <laughs> have you seen anybody else? No, but I do have a ton of questions for Ozzy. Ozzy Osbourne. Great job sabotaging the party! What? It was your evil plan to ruin everything, wasn't it? I would have preferred a little more pizzazz, but all in all, congratulations. That was an accident, Vagar. So you didn't plan to crash the whole portal, ne the whole portal network? No. F what fee? What a bore. What do you mean fee? Why are you weird, man? Okay. Good job. I'll take any kind of help right now. I wish I could help Clover. Hold it. Now is not the time for self-pitying. Do you have any idea what might have caused this? I think Ozzy was using unsafe party yarn. It looked all messed up. Unfortunately, that does sound like him. Did you find out anything useful? I've checked the bridges. They're all down. The elevators don't work either. So the portals and the bridges are broken. This is it. We're stuck here. Forever. I was hoping to get back by midnight, not by never. <laughs> okay. My schedule is ruined. No technical part shipments for a while. So I guess so I guess my life as a trader is over. Come on, Penelope. Don't be so melodramatic. What do I even do? What am I good at? I guess you are good at asking questions. <laughs> this guy. Exactly, I'm going to be a journalist. Oh my god. This is impossible. I mean, I've teleported to wrong islands before, but I guess it takes real skill to destroy the whole portal system at once. Yes, yes, I wonder what powerful wizard could have done this. Vegar, what are you doing here? Don't you have some slugs to scare? The bridges are down? Whatever happened at the party, it shook the whole island really hard. So now Yarnville isn't the only one that separated. What? I'm just thinking out loud, sorry, sorry. How did you escape? I wasn't exactly on the dance floor, but I was though. I mean, I went to get a drink. These dances are so exhausting. They use the exhaust summoner spell on her. How do we get out of here now? Luckily, I know someone who has a flying machine. Is it Corky? Let's hope he saw what happened and is on his way. I'm wondering, is there some secret way to reactivate the portal? If there is, my teacher Grams would know about it. He's in Yarnville. Okay, can I move? I can't move. It is Corky! You know, this wasn't a simple case of a bad party pooper, was it? Party popper. Party pooper. This had to be at least a batch of janky firecrackers. You're just in time, Corky. We need an evac from the upper part of the island ASAP. But first, get this yordle to Yarnville. Yarnville? Now that brings back some memories. Find me in Bandel Center when you get back. Don't fall down, don't fall down. Say again! Huh? I didn't say anything. So how do you know Gramps? We go way back. Trusted companion, no Delta Sierra. What? His parties, nice, no loud music, only knitting. <laughs> what? 
Cool, 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 cool. Oh my god. What the? That's impossible. Huh? Please, sweetie, stop it. Fasten your seatbelt. We're going down. Last part did you not did not copy? <laughs> We're going down, you fool. My copter, my beautiful copter. I don't understand. They checked everything twice over. Corky, I need to find Gramps. But I'll come back, I promise. To my beautiful copter. Okay, guys, stop. Um. I'm here. I need to go home. I need to sleep, save, and finish the video. Wait, I know where I am. I think. Wait. Wait, 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 wait. What's this? Yay, we found the backpack. I can go to sleep and I can save. Nice. Okay. So this will be it for this video. It already got to be a little long. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It's kind of fun. I think I'll keep playing it for a while and see what's going to happen. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like, a subscribe, comment, and let me know if you want the second part. Till then, goodbye. Peace out.